my personal teaching philosophy has grown in so many ways since I began student teaching. Um, you know, when you first start, you know the textbook definitions and you know the textbook reasons, but it's not until you actually get your hands in there that you understand those reasons. Um, one example is I always kind of thought that when you begin teaching, you're just kind of thrown in there and you, you just figure it out. And that couldn't be farther from the truth. Um, it's definitely a collaborative effort. Um, your coworkers and your um, side teachers are always there to help, and that's such a that's a, such a big deal. Um, cultures, respect for cultures. I actually have several different um, cultural backgrounds in quite a few of my classes, and it's nice to actually make an impact on these students. Um, you can see how they pick up on what you believe or what you think or how you teach. And um, when you teach respect and when you teach that it's okay to be different, um, that we can still get along, they pick up on that and they learn from that. And I feel like that's a big deal for the future. Um, a really good example is the importance of learning about your students. Um, several weeks ago, I was having a lot of problems with one of my classes. Um, there were several students that were just disruptive. They wouldn't listen. They were not paying attention. Nothing I did would get through to them. Um, they were just disrupting. And um, I mean, I didn't understand why I tried everything I could think of. So finally, during class one day, I just stopped you know, mid lecture and I said, okay, we're going to do something different. And we went around the room and I had every student tell me something specific about themselves. Um, so when it got to this one specific student, um, I found out that he had lost his mother and he was dealing with a lot of problems at home and everything started to make sense. It just resonated with me. So it's really important to understand and know your students and know why they're doing what they're doing, regardless of what that may be. Um, so for tablets, um, technology, we have tablets, and it's such a big help. For instance, um, for my English class, I found a website called afterschoolhelp.com, and it has so many practice tests and um, comprehension checks and things like that that um, really help pretty much take a load off. So technology definitely creates, you know, a better, a better learning environment. Um, so for integrating the Christian worldview, um, that's easy for me to do. I feel like that's something that for a Christian comes naturally. Um, you naturally should have compassion and, um, you know, I think you should know your policies and your procedures to make sure that you're doing everything legally and ethically. Um, and always ask if you're unsure of something. That's something I found out. People are always willing to answer your questions, and I've had a million of them. So, um, yeah, uh, being that I'm student teaching at a private school, that's another uh, blessing for me that I get to be open um, in the Christian faith, and, and that's, you know, a really big deal. But yeah, thank you.